okay we are done with our user controller now you can see that and uh, we are using the dependency injection so we will give and allocate memory inside of the startup to achieve the dependency injection okay so what i am going to do so it's service dot inside of services there are three method add transit scope and single thread so i am using the scope and generate now i user and the user services with uh, interacting with each other so i just using the i user and i include the name space you can see that this is the name space of the i user again i'm just going and then include the name space of the user services now this is the name space of the user services so i allocated the memory okay then and read I don't think we do, we get any error. Okay, repeat all succeed. We didn't get any error. 